Hey everyone, welcome back. It's time to talk about the 5 best tips and tricks to fix macOS Tahoe 26 Beta not installing on Mac. Excited to try out the macOS Tahoe 26 Beta but your Mac just won't install the update. Don't worry because I have got you fully covered with some quick fixes. That's it. Let's get started. Before anything else, I would recommend you to check if your Mac is eligible for macOS Tahoe 26 Beta. Apple tends to drop support for older models with major releases. To verify, go to the Apple menu at the top left corner of the screen. And then you have to choose about this Mac option in the menu. And then you have to check the model and year. And then you have to compare it with Apple's official list of compatible devices for macOS 26. If your device isn't compatible, the update won't appear on your device. Then I will recommend you to enroll in the Apple Beta software program. If you are trying to access the beta version, your Mac needs to be enrolled in the Apple Beta software program or have a developer profile installed. To enroll, you have to head over to the beta.apple.com or developer.apple.com and then you have to sign in with your Apple ID. After that, you have to download and install the macOS Beta Access Utility and after installing, go to the System Settings app on your Mac. Then choose General. After that, select Software Update and now you should see the Beta app here. Then I will recommend you to check your internet connection. MacOS Beta updates are large in size and require a stable and fast internet connection. If your Wi-Fi is spotty, the download may fail or get stuck midway. To ward off this problem, I will recommend you to restart your router and reconnect to the network. Besides, I would also suggest you avoid using VPNs or proxies during the software update. If needed, switch to a wired connection. Then I will recommend you to free up enough space for the macOS Tahoe 26 Beta. Note that macOS updates require several gigabytes of free space. If your Mac is running low on storage, the update won't install at all. To check and clear the space, you have to open the System Settings app on your Mac. Then choose General. After that, select Stories. And then you have to delete unused apps, large files, or old backups to retrieve as much space on your Mac as possible. And finally, I will recommend you to restart your Mac because it has the knack of fixing many common macOS problems. To do so, you have to head over to the Apple menu located at the top left corner of the screen. And then you have to choose the Restart option in the menu. And once your Mac has rebooted, you have to go back to the same software update section and try installing the update to check whether or not it sorts out the problem. Hopefully, it manages to fix the problem and you are able to install the macOS 26 beta without any hassle at all. And that's about it. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and I'll catch you up in the next one.